Yo, what's going on, pimp? It's Jason Capital here with an up and close and personal. Trust yourself and keep fucking going. 2015. Lots of guys have been asking, Jason, where is this year's trust yourself? And keep fucking going video. Well, you know what? You know what's taking so long to, to record it or why it's taking so long? Do you know why? Because I don't know why. I don't fucking know why it took so long, right? But I didn't do it because I wasn't inspired to do it, all right? I didn't feel right. I trusted myself on that one. Now, Sunday night, January 3rd, driving home from the gym, banging out to this new Showtech song. It's fucking great. I had inspiration. It dawned on me. It came to me. So I'm here, okay? I trusted myself, and I kept fucking going. And that's what I did all of 2015, and it is, it is exactly what I'm going to do in 2016, and it is exactly what you are going to do in 2016 as well, all right, 2015 was a great fucking year for me, did I have problems, fuck yeah, I had problems, I had crazy fucking problems, did I talk about them, no, I'm a fucking man, all right, I'm gonna handle my shit, okay, did I have some successes, fuck yeah, I had some successes, all right, fuck yeah, Fucking beautiful, okay? We added 25,000 plus guys to Team Capital this year. Fucking beautiful. More transformations, more guys getting the girls they want, getting the money they want, having the friends they want, getting the connections they want, doing the things that they want to do. What they want, when they want, with who they want, all right? Because they trust themselves and they keep fucking going. Really good fucking year for me too, right? I made over $2 million this year. Pretty fucking good. Am I satisfied? Fuck no, I'm not satisfied, all right? I want 10 fucking million dollars and I want to transform 100 million badass motherfuckers. And you, my friend, are one of them, all right? Because this year, you trusted yourself and you kept fucking going. You kept working on yourself. You kept building your value. You expanded your social circle. You became a social guy. You became an attraction guy. You increased your status. And it fucking showed. Your family noticed. Your friends noticed. Everyone fucking notices. You are fucking evolving. You are fucking growing. You are going to heights that you didn't even know were possible for yourself. And I'm telling you right now, man, I'm looking at you right in the fucking eyes right now. You don't even know how fucking great you could be or how fucking great you're going to be in 2016 because you are going to trust yourself here with me on Team Capital and you are going to keep fucking going, all right? 2016 is gonna be a fucking amazing year for us, all right? In two weeks from now, I got the Badass Mentor Retreat in Vegas. We have uh, over 220 fucking guys signed up already, all right? We're already oversold for the venue. We're gonna be doing more. It's gonna be an amazing fucking year. I spent all day working on a new training this year. It's gonna come out later this year. It's the best shit I've ever fucking done because every fucking year of my life is the best fucking year of my life because I get better. I, I follow the team capital creed. I wrote it, but I fucking follow it to a T. I take huge action. I bet on myself. I lean into my edges. I say yes to adventure. I surround myself with the best people. I never fucking peep. I increase my status every fucking day and I trust myself and I keep fucking going. So let's look at some facts before I get out of here. What were the, the biggest problems or the biggest mistakes that you made in 2016? I'll be fucking honest as shit right now. I'll tell you some of mine, all right? Why the fuck not? Let me think off the dome. Hmm. I dropped almost 200 fucking G's this year. I'm living like a fucking boss. It's literally just living like a fucking boss. Just on private jets and first class flights and butlers and fucking, I don't know, $3,000 jackets, bottles, crazy shit. Okay, crazy shit. Fucking mistake. Should I have done that? I don't fucking know. It was fun as shit. Would I do it again? Mm, maybe. Maybe not. I don't fucking know. Maybe not to the extent that I did. All right? It was a little excessive. Whatever. All right? I learned from it. I grow from it. I accept it. It's all fucking good. What else? Well, hmm, let me think. I actually, I treated some of the most important people in my life like shit this year for a little bit there. Not the whole year. Just a little bit there in exchange for some strange. Was that the best idea? Probably not. All right, probably fucking not. I keep fucking growing from every fucking mistake because I pull the lessons out of it and because I trust myself. I trusted myself then and I trust myself right fucking now. What were some of the biggest wins for you in 2015? What's gonna be the biggest win for you in 2016? Why does that excite you? What's gonna be the most exciting thing that's gonna happen to you in 2016? Why do you love that that's gonna happen? Why do you love that you love that that's gonna fucking happen? Why do you love that so many girls 
are gonna be chasing you in 2016. Why do you love that they should be fucking chasing you? Because you're the fucking man in 2016. Why do you love Jason Capital? Why do you love this moment right now? Why are you so charged up and so excited about yourself and your life and your world right fucking now? 2016 is going to be the best fucking year of your life. And my man, I cannot wait to fucking see it. You're the fucking man. I'm Jason Capital. Peace, dude.